Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I um, have another wig review to do. Um, I was contacted by Eva Hare um, and I picked a beautiful, very colorful wig um, to do a review on and I received it in the mail today. So here it is, uh, Eva Hare and it comes in a very sleek black box. Um, you can find them at www.evahair.com. So here's the beautiful box. And this is the way that it came packaged. If you can see the turquoise and black, oh, I'm so excited. Um, in with the wig, they provided me with a package of two nude wig caps, which will come in handy, um, because I still haven't decided what I'm doing with my own hair, but I'm going to have to decide soon, because I'm going to have to start, uh, wearing wig caps, um, or I should just cut it off. You know what? Tell me in the comments down below. Leave me a comment. Tell me, should I just say... Um, I'm to hell with it and like cut all my hair off again. Should I let my hair grow out and wear wig caps? Tell me what you think. So here is the beauty. I'm going to go ahead and open this. It's, um, got styrofoam in it. Not styrofoam. Not styrofoam. It has... He comes in the plastic bag. It has tissue paper. Thank you. And a hairnet. You take the hairnet off. Look. Would you look? Would you just look at this? Would you look at this? Look. Oh my gosh. Jet black. Electric blue. Gorgeous. Take the tissue paper out. Okay, the um, material, it's got the tag attached. The material, it says, is high temperature resistant silk. Excellent, heat safe. In the style number, SNZ, electric blue. So, that is the tag. I'm going to go ahead and take the tag off. All right, so it does have the soft lace um which i love it has an incredible amount look at that of parting space it goes almost all the way back to the would be about right to here and you can part it anywhere you want um, deep side part middle part so that's great um like I said, it's soft lace, and it looks like it's um, going to be really easy to match to my skin tone. I'm going to flip it inside out for you. And just stick my fingers right through the cap, because you know why not. So, um, basic stretch cap. Um, it has three combs. One in, would be towards the front, one on each side, here and here. And one back here um, by the adjustable bands. Um, I've said it a million times, I like to take these bands and hook them together instead of hooking them in the cap. Just my preference, I find it works better for me. So, um, what I'm gonna do is go ahead and brush this out and put it on with the lace still attached so you can get an idea of what it looks like straight out of the box. Woo! Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. So, first impressions, let me tell you what I think uh, with the lace on. Um, it is big head friendly. Um, I have a lot of extra cap space, which isn't a problem. I can uh, take wefts out and sew the cap back together. Um, I should probably do a video on that so you guys can see how I do that when 
when I get a wig that's too big. This is breathtaking. I'm just, I'm just in love. So, um, first impressions, the, uh, I love the widow's peak. Um, let me pull it down just a little bit. Absolutely gorgeous. Uh, what I'm gonna do is go ahead and cut the lace off so you can get a better idea and of what it's gonna look like and I will be right back. Hey guys, so I'm back. Um, so I cut the lace off and uh, put it back on for you. Um, I'm gonna get close so you can see the hairline. It um, is pretty standard looking. Oh my goodness. Did I just do that on camera? It's a pretty standard looking hairline as far as uh, synthetic wigs. Um, the hair, the color of it is absolutely beautiful. I hope that the camera does it justice. Um, I mean, I don't know how anybody could not just feel as sexy as hell in this wig. Um, with the jet black, the widow's peak, and um, you can see a little bit of my hairline. What? Um, with the electric blue, my goodness. Um, so, uh, after, um, there's the hairline. So, I can definitely tell you that I'm going to do some work with this wig. Um, I am going to customize the hairline, which will consist of me putting it on um, my good old styrofoam head with my T-pins and um, plucking. Uh, lots and lots of plucking. Uh, pluck this hairline to make it look a little more natural. Uh, glue it down. Take out some of these wefts to make it fit my head better. And I'm telling you that I will definitely rock this thing. Um, it is it is beautiful. Um, it you can part it anywhere. Um, it has a the a lot of parting space and um, you can brush it to either side the colors just amazing so anyway um, again this we'll go back to this side because this is my preference mm, I just can't and the wig came from evahair.com um, I will put the link down below to this um, to this beautiful wig and uh, also I will put the link to my Facebook page feel free to message me ask me any question um, don't forget the little subscribe button and check out the other videos on my channel I have lots of other wig reviews um, and I post more all the time so I uh, want to thank you all for watching have a great day